The European Union EU, is an economic and political union of 28 member states. It operates on the Eurozone, with a single currency and a central banking system. The EU's main purpose is to promote peace, stability and cooperation among its member states. The Union has established itself as a major economic power with significant trade and economic relations with other countries. It also has a strong commitment to animal welfare and conservation. The EU's Common Agricultural Policy, CAP, which was established in 1962, is a cooperation between agriculture and society as well as between Europe and its farmers. The major objectives of this policy are to increase agricultural production in order to provide consumers with a consistent supply of inexpensive food and to guarantee that EU farmers can live comfortably. All countries in the EU have a strong economic relationship with agriculture. Agricultural products represent 40% of the total value of exports from the EU. Agricultural production is also concentrated in Western Europe, where most agricultural land is located. This high level of agricultural production makes the EU an important market for agricultural goods. Agricultural producers also have to comply with strict standards of production in the EU to compete in this market. All of the European Union's member states share the CAP as their common policy. The resources of the yearly EU budget are used to administer and finance it at the European level. The EU now faces more obstacles than it did 50 years ago. In order to feed the predicted 9 billion people that will inhabit the planet by the year 2050, food production would need to more than double on a worldwide scale. Climate change, the sustainable management of natural resources, maintaining the rural economy, and caring for the countryside across the EU are additional issues. The most recent changes, implemented in 2013, switched the emphasis to more environmentally friendly agricultural methods, research and information dissemination, a more equitable support system for farmers, and a bigger role for farmers in the food chain. The EU's Rural Development Policy, sometimes referred to as the second pillar of the Common Agricultural Policy, has evolved throughout time to reflect shifting important EU goals. For the years 2014 to 2020, it has been altered in accordance with the broader CAP reform. Many farmers have been able to improve infrastructure, carry out necessary restructuring, and acquire new skills thanks to its emphasis on investing for success. These actions have helped them gain a competitive advantage. To increase agricultural exports, the EU has created incentives to promote European products in foreign countries. For example, all member states use the same quality controls and safety standards for agricultural products exported from the EU. Additionally, member states make sure their agricultural producers have proper lab equipment, transportation, storage and education opportunities to export their products effectively. Each country in the EU also has a state farm that provides marketing opportunities for farmers in less developed parts of the EU. These measures have helped European agriculture become one of the strongest industries worldwide. The EU has designed a single market for agricultural products to make it easier for farmers to sell their products throughout the Union. They've also made sure that regulations protect consumers from unsafe food by code food quality standards and environmental safeguards. All member states must follow strict food safety standards according to the Codex Alimentarius Commission. They must also accredit veterinaries and animal health professionals according to the European Professional Guild for Veterinary and Animal Health, EPGAH. All these measures ensure high standards of quality for agricultural products exported from the EU.